When an alkene reacts with a hydrogen halide, a halogenoalkane, also called a haloalkane, is formed. A hydrogen halide is a molecule made up of a hydrogen atom bonded to a halogen atom, fluorine, chlorine, bromine or iodine. To get any reaction started with an alkene, we need to have an electrophile. A hydrogen halide molecule is polar. This is because the halogen will always have a higher electronegativity than the hydrogen it is bonded to, and as a result, will attract the electrons in the bond towards itself and end up with a partial negative charge, leaving the hydrogen with a partial positive charge. This means the hydrogen becomes electron deficient and is able to act as an electrophile. As a hydrogen halide molecule approaches the carbon-carbon double bond in an alkene, the electron-deficient hydrogen will accept the pi bonding electrons from the double bond and form a new bond to one of the carbon atoms. This breaks open the double bond and a single sigma bond gets left between the two carbon atoms, meaning the carbon chain doesn't get broken. The pi bond contains one electron from each of the carbon atoms, meaning as it breaks and a new bond with that pair of electrons gets made, one of the carbon atoms effectively loses an electron. As a result, this other carbon atom ends up with a positive charge. An ion that contains a carbon atom with a positive charge is called a carbocation. As all this is happening, the bond between the hydrogen and halogen will break. The pair of electrons from the bond go to the halogen and become a lone pair. The halogen ends up becoming a negatively charged halide ion. The reaction now just proceeds as expected. The negatively charged halide ion will get attracted to the positively charged carbon in the intermediate and use its new lone pair of electrons to form a bond to it, forming the final product. The hydrogen and halogen from the hydrogen halide end up bonded to the two different carbon atoms from the double bond in the alkene. The species that initially attacked the carbon-carbon double bond was the partially positive hydrogen from the hydrogen halide, and it acted as an electrophile accepting a pair of electrons, making the reaction electrophilic. Both atoms from the hydrogen halide molecule got added to the alkene and only one product was formed making the reaction an addition reaction. As a result of both of these things, we describe the reaction and mechanism as electrophilic addition.